Hi y'all, Belle here from SBG and more, and today I have Southern Arsenal with me. Hello. And we are going to be trying some foreign drinks, so stay tuned. Alright, so like we said before, we're going to be taste testing these foreign sodas that came from the Asian Isle in H-E-B. That's literally what it said. It said Asian Isle. So, um, there's a lot of good flavors here. Some of them cost two or three dollars. Um, these down here were more one dollar. Yep. Arsenal has actually tasted the original. Um, I never have, so I'm starting very basics of it and it doesn't actually have a flavor at least I don't think it says a flavor it doesn't say a flavor, it doesn't say a flavor but it looks like this and I cannot pronounce obviously there's writing that I can't say on here so um but we're gonna go ahead and let you know a little bit of what the flavors are this one what is that leech what is that I don't even know what that is I guess a berry type so this one's leech why don't you start from that end grape Great. This one's blueberry. Very distinct blue. Raspberry. Ooh. This one's melon. Peach. I wonder if they're going to taste like we think. Or are they going to be a little different? I think they're going to be completely different than what we think. Green apple flavor. Strawberry. Okay. And this one is coconut, which I do not like coconut. Um, I'm not even sure why we decided to get this. Probably to be mean to me. That's what I'm guessing. But we're going to try all of these out. <laughs> we are going to have to tear off these little, you know, safety things, which is good. It means no one else is drinking them. And uh, then we'll, I guess, one by one take a sip. All right, so we took off all the like little label things, Label's, I guess, yeah. the little things that contained it, and these are completely different to open than here in America. And I know nothing, and he knows a little bit more than me, so I'm gonna go ahead and let him explain it. And if not, we'll figure this out together. <laughs> okay, so you just there's a little. I'm not sure if you can see that from there. This little, I guess, press. You break it off this cap and push it on the marble. Like so you pop this off. Get the cap. Huh? So and get this. And so you put that right there because this is what it looks like on yeah. top. If you can see, it's just like a little dot, I guess. It's a marble. Oh, it's a marble. That does that go in here or in there? It, it goes in here. Oh, okay. So there's like a little marble looking type thing. I don't know what it, what it is. If that's what it is or not. You grab this. If you is that what it sounds like? That sounds yeah. so scary. You put it on top of here. Let me show you guys. I'm going to go ahead and move this right here. Put it on top of here. And then you... Mm, maybe I shouldn't do it. Mm, oh! Woo, look at it. Oh, my gosh. <laughs> and then it opens. So we're going to be doing that, too. All of them. All of them. There's a marble in here. Where's it at? Right there. Oh, look, guys. It's right there. I guess it got caught right there. That's pretty cool. You see, I don't know if you can see it's moving around in there like that. It keeps you from drinking too fast. Because if you turn it upside down, like it catches the marble. Does it really? Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. So now we're going to be doing this to uh, all of them. I think I'm only going to be using one thing. I don't want to have to pop all these lids off. I did too. Proud of me? <laughs> there. <laughs> You're drinking that one. Why? That's the coconut one. I don't like the smell of it. So now that 
Arsenal has done the majority of opening because it's kind of hard. You have to really put pressure on it. And these are carbonated because they're sodas. Um, so there was only one that fizzed and might have had the possibility of flowing over, but it didn't. Um, so how do you want to do this, Arsenal? You want to start from this side or that side? You want, I guess let's start with the original. Start with the original. Now, this is my best friend. I've known him for God knows how long. Um... Yeah, we used to be in a Western inter uh, entertainment group and everything. We'd camp out and be there. So we've shared drinks before and everything. Um, so I'm not concerned about having a cup. Besides, you can see it straight from the bottle then. Ah. So you've already tasted this, mm -hmm. right? So yeah. I'll be the first one to taste it. I've never tasted any kind of uh, foreign drinks at all. Um, I've eaten some foreign things, but I've never drank anything. So bottoms up. I mean, it's not bad. I don't. I wouldn't drink it personally. Of course, y'all know I love my Dr. Pepper, so I don't really drink a whole lot of other drinks. Period. Um, I do drink Mountain Dew or um, strawberry lemonade. Well, that's not soda though. I love strawberry oh, yeah. lemonade, but soda wise, I drink Mountain Dew sometimes, and um, really just Dr. Pepper Mountain Dew. I, guess, I would say. So this is okay. It doesn't really. I don't know how to describe it. You want to go ahead and drink it? And it really, you can't drink much of it. It won't let you. It tastes like flat Coke. Flat Coke? Yeah. Maybe, yeah, maybe. Or flat Sprite? No. Coke? Yeah, flat Sprite. It's like, to me, of course, I know a lot of countries don't aren't as flavorful as us, I, I think, from what I understand or what I've been told. Um, like, I love dark pepper and it has to be just right. This tastes more like a flat Sprite yeah. or something along those lines. Maybe a ginger ale? Yeah, that, yeah, a flat ginger ale. That's what it tastes more Tastes like. like a flat ginger ale, which I'm not a fan of ginger ale in general. I don't. But it t this one tastes like a flat ginger ale. So would you give it a thumbs up or a thumbs down? I wouldn't really give it anything. I don't hate <laughs> it. I'm like, ah, I don't hate it, but I don't. I don't love it particularly. So, all right, thumbs up from Arsenal. Eh, from me. <laughs> On to the next one. Leech. Was I even showing it to y'all? Leech. Yeah, I think you did. Leech. I don't even know what leech is, to be honest with you. Do you want to test this one first? Yeah, I'll do it. like it. I feel like you're lying to me. It's pretty good. Don't, are, it, are you for real? Yeah. I was like, don't lie. What, like, what does it taste like to you? And if you say leech, then you, <laughs> I'm gonna hurt you. Ooh. Um, like apple, like, kind of like, like an apple. Apple. Like it smells like perfume. It tastes so good. Smell it. Smell like perfume. Yeah, it does. I'm almost afraid. I don't. <gasps> like carbonated apple, if it was a drink. Yeah, it does. It tastes like apple. Like not even not like artificial flavoring apple. It tastes like if you really were eating an apple, which I don't really like apples. I like applesauce that has like uh, <laughs> cinnamon in it or apple pies, but I don't really like an apple itself. But this like literally tastes like an apple. Like the juice that you when you eat it, it tastes like an apple. Uh, I don't even know what kind of berry things these are, but this tastes like an apple. <laughs> uh, what would you rate it? I mean, would you say thumbs up or thumbs down? You like it? Oh yeah, you said you liked it. I don't like apples. I'm so, I'm so close-minded. I don't really like apples in general. Um, I'm like, it's, it doesn't taste bad, mind you. It does not taste bad. It's just not my cup of tea, so I, I don't give it anything because it's not bad. I'll let y'all know if it tastes terrible, um, but I do know I'm a little more close-minded when it comes <laughs> to drinking and eating things, so yeah. I think this one right here is going to be her favorite. He's lying. No, yeah, yeah. <laughs> All right, so the next one we have is blueberry flavor. Blueberry flavor. <laughs> flavor, flavor, flavor. Blueberry. So, do you want to try this first, or do you want me to? You had. I tried the last one first. 
can I smell this? It tastes, it's, I mean, it's, it, it smells like a candle. Yeah, yeah. It smells candle-ish. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go ahead. I'm gonna go ahead and taste it. Like I said, this is blueberry flavor, it says. This one's okay. It doesn't really have a lot of flavor to it. Kind of like cotton candy to me. Yeah, yeah, this kind of tastes like... It's cotton candy with a drink. <laughs> That's a lot of carbonation. <laughs> yeah, it kind of tastes like it's it's, an, it's not as sweet as cotton candy, obviously, but it's like a cousin of cotton candy. So the blueberry one kind of tastes like cotton candy. Um, I'll go ahead and give this one a thumbs up. I don't, I probably wouldn't drink it again, but I give it a thumbs up because it's actually it's somewhat pleasant. I would say. <laughs> you give it a thumbs up. Too? I give it a thumbs up. Too. Thumbs up. I have a feeling I'm going to like all of these, except for this one and this one. Strawberry? Yeah. The next one is melon. So, uh, you <laughs> get to taste it first this time. What does it smell like? Wait, what does it smell like? Because we care about the smell, man. <sighs> like a melon. What does it taste like? Like a melon. <laughs> what kind of melon? A very... Not like cantaloupe, but... Oh. I don't <laughs> like the smell. I... Uh, oof. Oof. <laughs> I don't like the drink, smell! Drink. Drink. I'm very close-minded. I'm not even gonna lie. I'm so close-minded. It's not bad. <laughs> That's a thumb down for her. I don't like it though. I don't like it at all. It's like I don't know what to describe. What would you say? I guess it just tastes like a melon. To you? Like I don't melon. like melon. I don't like cantaloupe. I don't like. I don't like watermelon. I don't like. I don't like the stuff that's good for you. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna go ahead and take this one too. All right. Wait. What is it? Where she goes. <laughs> Green apple is the next. Flavor. Oh, this smells like green apple. <laughs> oh yeah, it does. It straight up just smells like green apple Jolly Ranchers. Tastes like green apple. Like Jolly Ranchers? No. Oh. I was, I was, I was ready for that. If it tastes like green Jolly Ranchers, I'm like, woohoo! Mmm. 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 It's okay. It's not bad. I want a gin. I want a Jolly Ranchers though. <laughs> okay. I'd give that one a thumbs up. I give it a thumbs up too. Bell, you got the next one? Uh, no. <laughs> <laughs> That's why I did these two first. That's why I took them first because coconut. Okay, I'll make you a deal. If you drink the coconut first, I'll drink the strawberry one first. I don't care if you drink the strawberry one first. <laughs> Coconut. Yeah, you wouldn't like that. I give it a thumbs up. Thumbs down for Bill. Do I have to drink it? I'm gonna drink the strawberry. <laughs> I shouldn't smell it. <laughs> yeah, just take a gulp of it. I need a chaser! <laughs> <laughs> Chase that was another one. Don't smell it. <laughs> Get back at me. Oh god, it's square. I'm sorry. I was trying to drink it fast. It just got all over everywhere. You cannot drink. I don't think you can really drink these fast. No, you can't. It will not let you drink it fast. Okay, so, me... did we really drink that much, or the moment you drink it, it goes like? No, well, we drank that much. Or I did at least. I think it's sprayed everywhere. The next one is gonna be uh watermelon. Watermelon! Mm -hmm. Here you go, Bob. 
I guess it smells watermelon y, right? Yep. That's watermelon. I don't really drink watermelon either. You don't drink watermelon? I don't eat watermelon either. I don't eat any kind of melon. You get into the world of Bell and see how close minded my food and drinking world is. I don't necessarily eat any of these often, but I'll okay. eat it if it's there. That, I think that tastes like watermelon. I like that juices from it. I, I feel like they just got a watermelon and just squashed the juices out into it. Cool. Right? Does it taste like watermelon? Tastes like something. <laughs> it tastes like watermelon to not, me. Not to me. Like, well, I when I grew, grew growing up, I ate watermelon with salt. So. Oh, I've never done that before. Of course, I, I probably had the bad watermelons. I probably like had a bad watermelon, and that's why I just don't like watermelon. I'm close. But I'm like, I don't want it anymore. No, that one time, that one time, it was disgusting. So I don't want it anymore. <laughs> <sighs> The next one is strawberry. It smells like some lip gloss I had back in the day when I used to have like those, you know, when you're younger, you have flavor lip glosses. Yeah. Drink it. You want me to drink it first? What do you think of it? What's it taste like? Artificial strawberry. Actually, this has a twang like a real strawberry. It doesn't taste like artificial strawberries. This is like, like after you eat a strawberry, he don't eat strawberries either. After you t bite into a strawberry, and it like has like this after effect after you eat, put it in your mouth and chew on it. It tastes like that. That's like, I mean, of course it tastes carbonated, but like the flavor tastes like real strawberries. I think all these drinks, I think in America, we're so used to artificial flavors and stuff like this. I think a, a lot of these drinks are just keep it real. It's actually tasting like the fruit that it is. Yep. So I give it a thumbs up, Arsenal. <laughs> this one is going to be a peach. Peach. Oh, that smells good. Yeah. I like the smell of it. It does smell good. Not so much the taste, though. No? <laughs> no. What does it taste like? Like peach. Like, it has a, like an off, not off putting taste, but it's like, it's off. It tastes off to me. Okay. It smells really good, though. It does. It smells really, really good. It always comes back at me. Ooh. This tastes, okay. I do not promote alcohol at all, but this tastes like an alcoholic beverage I've had before. I'm over the age of 21. If you're below the age of 21, do not drink. Um, but this tastes like an alcoholic drink I've had in from somewhere. Like it has that, you know, you know how alcoholic drinks have that twang to it, you know. So it's like it wants to be peach, but it like. Hey, I'm also something else. I'm also something else that you probably had late one night. <laughs> we have raspberry. Oh, I like the smell of this one, too. I don't. <laughs> I don't like the smell of that at all. Does that mean no? You think it's... What does it taste like? Tell me. Give me some descriptions, Arsenal. I don't know what that tastes like. If you ever had the, like, the Propel drinks, that tastes like dragon fruit. That's what that tastes like. Oh god, I already know I don't like dragon fruit. Dragon fruit's an actual fruit. <laughs> yeah, I know. But it tastes like that Propel drink, though. Is it Propel or one? Vitamin one. I don't know, I'm not healthy. <laughs> okay! What do I do wrong? I think, you try, I think you try to push on it. You have to leave it open. Like an <laughs> airway. I don't like it either. Okay, and... I don't know how to drink these drinks. I'm just like... Chug it here in America. The last one is grape. I like grape. Oh, this is ruin it for me. Ooh, it smells like grape soda. Because <laughs> it is grape soda. Hmm, it smells like Welch's. Not grape soda, it smells like Welch, Welch's grape juice. Go ahead and take a first drink. 
I did the first thing of most of these anyway. No, you didn't. We took turns. Starting from here, this way. I took the most. It's alright. It's nothing special. <laughs> it's like a flavored down stuff. It's not even like good like Welch's. Ooh, I like that one. Do you? Yeah, I, it I does, do. To me, it doesn't have the flavor. Like, I want more flavor. Like, okay, it's better than a lot of these. <laughs> yeah. But. In the here range. But, I mean, it's, it's, I wouldn't drink it again. All right. So, these were taste testing these foreign drinks. Now, a lot of these got a thumbs down from me. Because <laughs> I'm close-minded. What was your favorite one, Arsenal? Like, did, if you had to pick one that you would possibly finish the rest of. That wasn't the first one of flavor, the first ah! one, like a flavor one that you had to drink. What, which one would you drink? Probably this one. The leech, because it tastes like apple. Well, there you have it, folks. He likes that one. Um, if I had to choose one that I would actually drink all of, I really don't know, to be honest. Um, coconut? <laughs> no. I forgot that was coconut. Um, there was one that I didn't mind the flavor. I guess strawberry. Because it tastes more... I like strawberry. Um, and it tastes actually like a real strawberry. I, I, but I, I'm, I'm a complete, you know, big girl. And I like to put strawberries either in chocolate or in sugar. So, um, but... But, um... I would not drink any of these on my own. Because <laughs> we're so used to drinking like Dr. Pepper or Mountain Dew or Coca-Cola or Sprite and all that other stuff. And I do not like any of those watered down. As soon as it gets flat or watered down, I'm like, ugh. Anywhere I go, if I drink Dr. Pepper, I'm like, no ice. I'm not watering it down because I will not drink it. But these were, some of these were okay. I'm not used to, these taste a lot like the actual fruits themselves which i you know that's awesome because you know i feel like they're a lot healthier i know these are sodas i'm sure these are healthier than regular like american sodas but um these try to stick to the flavors of actual fruit which is pretty cool i think uh no you know because here in america i don't know what dr pepper tastes like it's artificial flavors of different stuff these actually kept it real to doing the fruits and i think that's pretty cool um so i i think that's cool some of these tasted weird to me because I'm just not used to it. And I'm very close-minded anyways. Arsenal, I think you like a lot of these, actually. Yeah. I... These ones I didn't. You didn't like any of these? You didn't like any of the berries? Yeah, I would say, besides the strawberry, I didn't really like... I didn't like any of them. They didn't taste like what they what I thought they would be. The peach, the everything. I definitely didn't like coconut. I don't like coconut in general. The coconut stayed true to tasting and smelling like coconut. <laughs> if you like coconut, that's all for you there. That's, that's taste and smell like coconut, but that's not for me. Um, the grape one, I wouldn't mind. I wouldn't mind drinking, uh, if I had to, but it, there's not a whole lot of flavor, like, like Welch's grape, you know, thing or whatnot. <laughs> um, it, it smelled like it though. It smelled so good. Um, this, yeah, this smelled like apples. Or tastes like apples. Yeah. I really don't like the juice and taste of apples, so I would hard pass. Uh, this one, the green apple flavor. This was okay. Um, I wanted it to taste like Jolly Ranchers, but this was actually one of the ones that... For, I guess this one I would drink again. Um, it, maybe not strawberry. I you think, want some demonstration? <laughs> this one I would drink again. I wouldn't really drink it. Ooh, it's very powerful, though. If you drink more than one drink, that's probably why you have to do it slowly. You know, they won't let you drink too much, which is pretty cool, I think, in general. But, oh, it does get, it gets stronger the more you drink it. Uh, whew. Okay, but we hope that you enjoyed this video. Uh, bonus review! <laughs> So, we just got finished tasting the sodas that we got from the Asian Island H-E-B. And we also got this. I got it because it looks good. <laughs> it is a cookie filled with chocolate cream. It's called Hello Panda. And I wanted to test these out. And I wanted to taste them. So, we're doing it together. <laughs> I'm excited about this, guys. Y'all have no clue. <laughs> Comes in a little red package. This right there. 
Raise down. Right, yeah. Let's open it up. Ooh. Whoa. Oh, I didn't know they were little nuggets. Like little. Those are bigger than I expected. They are? Yeah. Oh. This is what it looks like. So good. Oh, I don't know if you can see it. It has a little panda on it. It's adorable. <laughs> Go ahead and take one. And uh, me and Arsenal are going to try these together. It's just like a little cookie thing with um, chocolate on the inside. So I'm really interested. I don't know what chocolate tastes like for them. I don't know if it's different, you know. Yeah. Uh, it has to be different. But um, we're going to go ahead and try it. You ready? Yep. Three, two, one. Good. Oh yeah. Mmm. 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 They're good though. These are really good. How do you say that word? Maiji? Maiji? I don't know. But that's the brand Maiji, I think. M E I J I. It is really good. Oh look, I think they have different little prints on them. See? Well, here we are, just eating them. We're just eating them. We're not even looking there. If you see on here, on the box, there's different like little prints on the top of it. We weren't too concerned with it. We just wanted to eat it. <laughs> These are super, super good. It says serving size. Serving size is 10 pieces. There's two uh, serving size for is about two. So 10 of these is equals a serving size. Um, it has 160 calories. It is just so good. There it is. Oh, it tells you to tear here, and I was just like, oh, I want chocolate. It's good though. Uh, Y'all should try these. These I love. Any like the chocolate's good. Kung Fu Panda. <laughs> I'm gonna. Oh, I didn't even realize these are shaped like panda heads. Oh, well, they are. The little cookies are shaped like panda heads. I don't know if y'all can see it. But not only do they have little pandas on it, like little prints, they have it's shaped as a panda head. I'm gonna just try to eat part of it. Mmm. To show you the inside. That is what it looks like. This is, this is cream filled good stuff. Mmm. Mmm, 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 mmm. Mm. Thank you, H E B, for having that Asian eye. Mmm. So this is good. I would advise anyone to go get this if you like sweet stuff. I think it's a, I think it's a good combination because the cookie on the outside is not too sweet, but um, it with the inside of it makes it just right. It's rich enough, like where I can eat ten of these to be a serving, but it's not too sweet for me, so it's so good. Mm. I give it a thumbs up. I give it two thumbs up. Mm. we want to know your opinion what did you think about our taste test of our sodas um what is your opinion what flavor do you think you would have liked um what is your opinion on these do you like chocolates do you like sweets i do we'd love to hear from you and what should we taste test next time or what should i taste test next time leave a comment down below because we want to know what you think and if you haven't already make sure you smack that like button show it who's boss and hit that beautiful red subscribe button and while you're at it, while you're hitting beautiful red subscribe buttons, head on over to Arsenal's channel and hit his beautiful red subscribe button. Along with that, make sure you hit our bell. Hey, hit that bell. Not this bell, okay? I want to get smacked, okay? <laughs> <laughs> that way you get all the notifications when I have a live stream or if you go over to his channel when he has a live stream. I put out gaming videos. He puts out gaming videos. I have vlogs and we eating things and all sorts of different kind of things or helpful videos for you. So you're going to want to hit that bell notification. You hashtag notification squad. I'm the first one on the scene. We hope to see you in the next video, guys. Bye, y'all.